This morning I'm doing some pollination. Here is uh, Anthuria magnificum and you can see all the fluid, the stigmatic fluid or exudate on the um, inflorescence here. So that is receptive for pollen and there's an older fertilized inflorescence behind it. And then behind that there is a uh, clarinervium. But for now, we've got this Magnificum Spadix, nice and ready. So you just do this for a few mornings in a row. And here, Oroquianum has another inflorescence. There is the pollen, here is my paintbrush. So I'll gently collect some pollen. And brush it onto this surface. This is the last and I'll do last pass. So I'll do that for a few mornings in a row. Um, then down here, forgetty I already planted a couple of the berries. So forgetty I, um, crystallinum dark. And the old one that finished is here. And I planted those berries. You can still see some on the plant. So the berries I planted from that inflorescence of Magnificum crossed with Crystallinum Dark are here and they have sprouted. So cute. And there, there are a few other trays of it. And down here is another forgetty eye inflorescence.